What's up guys? This is Austin here with the Blender Bottle Trainer Team and today I'm going to be sharing three tips with you that's going to help you build a bigger chest. The first tip is I want you guys to prioritize using dumbbells over barbell. Dumbbells are going to help you create a better range of motion, which is going to allow you to stimulate your chest more efficiently. The second tip is tempo. I know you guys want to get into the gym and lift as heavy as you can, but it's not about how much you can lift, it's about the quality of each rep. And then we have the third tip, I want you guys to be training with different angles. A lot of us lack size and definition in our upper chest, so I'm going to show you guys what you guys can do to fix that problem today. For tip number one, I spoke to you guys about prioritizing dumbbells over barbell. And that's because you're gonna create a bigger range of motion with dumbbells, which is gonna lead to more stimulation in the chest. And I'm gonna show you guys what that looks like. So you're gonna lay back, chest up, shoulder blades pinched, and you're gonna press up. Now, with the barbell, you're limited to a certain range of motion, basically when the barbell touches your chest and then you have to push up and complete the rep. With dumbbells, you actually can go further past that range of motion, creating a bigger stretch in the chest, and then you can complete the rep. Now, another thing that you could do with dumbbells is turn your hands, depending on what you feel the most in your chest. So notice how now I'm turning the dumbbells as I lower them and as I complete the rep. For tip number two, I want you guys to focus on the rate at which I'm lowering and pushing up the dumbbells, and that's the tempo. Usually a tempo can be anywhere from four to three seconds down, and then two seconds up and contract. Remember, we're focusing on the quality of the rep. The weight does not matter. For tip number three, I spoke to you guys about training with different angles. So we're gonna raise the bench to a 45 degree angle and perform the same pressing movement just at a 45 degree angle. So we're leaning back, shoulder blades pinched, chest up, pressing up and contracting the chest hard. And this is what's gonna build that upper chest. Still focusing on tempo, lowering it with three seconds and pushing up for two seconds and contracting hard. And feel free to do movements like the chest fly or even a decline push up, because once again, to develop the chest, we need to be training the chest at all different kinds of angles. Thank you guys for tuning in with me. This is Awesome with Blender Bottle. There's more videos coming soon, and I'll see you next time.